Hey everybody, and welcome back for some more classic Thursday Night War. Let's jump back in. Oh, okay. Commander, we have multiple reports of new abductions in progress. Argentina. The on the Ooh, that's tempting. So is that. Okay, so we can we can go ahead and blow off a mission here because it doesn't matter too much because we will take that continent. And I'm okay with the panic going up a bit. We're not concerned about panic in Europe right now. We've kind of signed off on that being the one that we're going to let go. The continent we're going to not worry about. But getting a sniper sergeant is not a bad deal. And the reason I say that is because snipers, I think I mentioned, they're very much carry in Enemy Within. So until they get, you know, squad sight, really, they're just not very useful. But this could be good, picking up a sergeant. Yeah, I'm gonna do this. And we'll take this opportunity to put somebody else out in the field. So... Go like this. Who can we take? Speaking of snipers... Here, let's take Wee. We need to get him some experience. Yeah, you can. Okay. And then... Who's the next, like... Best rookie that we have? How are you? You're kind of marginal. You're okay. He's pretty good. All right, let's 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 bring Orhe. Okay. Yeah, that looks good. So we've got we've got we Ed Fell and Chavez. Let's go smash more alien faces. down. Listen up. We're going to be dropping you deep in the Nigerian interior for the next operation. Yeah, it looks like the it looks like it's deep inside the Nigerian territory at this shopping mall thing <laughs> or whatever this is. Central. Big Sky in position on approach of the abduction site. Strike 1 is awaiting drop clearance. Copy that, Big Sky. Strike 1 is cleared to engage Jeez, hostile this targets. this big map for Watch an easy mission. There, We're going to spend more time Looking for them, then we will actually no. shoot them. Position confirmed. That's all right, okay. though. That's all right. You know what? Actually, we should be safe to double move. Let's check the corner. Visual on the goods. Okay. Aye, aye, Commander. Got it. Moving out. With the meld canisters, we obviously don't want to dawdle. Heading to that location. Did I just hear Thin Man? Really? Thought this was supposed to be an easy mission, people. ET in sight. Engaging. I guess it's easy in terms of the numbers that you face, not necessarily the the actual enemies. What's the range on that thing? Like, that's pretty darn good. So, let's do this. Let's move here. Affirmative. We'll Overwatch. You're gonna break line of sight. Roger, Dodger. You're gonna dash up. Mm-hmm. You're gonna head inside. Okay. Okay, I need eyes on. Hmm. Where's the other guy? I don't think you can hit him with the sniper this close, right? Well, 56%. Well, try it. Nice! Okay. That was a hell of a shot. 
Okay, Chavez. I need you to... Oh, there he is. Okay. Um... That's kind of weird. A little bit of awkward situation. Moving to position. He's gonna get... He might get poisoned. But I think that's okay. Alright, let's move up. Oh, he didn't. Okay, great. Take the corner. Affirmative. Move up. Out. And up. On the move. I'm on it, Commander. Back in. Snap a reload. Down at the other end. Yeah, okay. Hey, what's up, Pigeon? You hear that? I affirmative. Go take a look, buddy. Mm-hmm. On the move. Okay, hang out right there. Yep. Come over to the middle. You're gonna go back through the building for us. Double time. Well. Thank you there, darling. Appreciate that. Because if they're right over here... Oh. They actually cut through the building themselves. Okay. Very sneaky. Very, very sneaky. I'm almost impressed. Alright, so... Let's see. Let's move out here like so. Mm-hmm. And then... Grenade. Operational objectives. Nice. Okay, perfect. High fives. Psh. Picked up a sergeant sniper. An exemplary performance. Let's hope all Oh, and got another promotion. This one did. Rapid reaction or heat ammo? Oh, definitely heat ammo. And then flush or uh, definitely rapid fire. Okay, so here's the deal with this setup. If you move, blue move in to the range of a target, then you can take a shot from close and close and personal again, because we're then four tiles. And then if they're not dead, you can then shoot again with rapid fire. So you end up effectively getting three shots off of an assault. It's pretty pretty awesome actually. But it does make them that this build is definitely gonna make them, you know, glass cannons. Remember. Let's take a look at that sniper we picked up. Snapshot, squad, uh... Well, his aim's not that great, so we actually probably want to go with squad sight. Or, excuse me, with, uh, snapshot. Because he can move and flank, right? I don't know. We'll try squad sight. And we can give him damn good ground for some extra aim. Make sure he's always upstairs. Alright, we'll we'll re rename him in a second. To be To be assigned. Oh, okay, so to be right. Last name assigned. Been a while since I've done this. Same thing with this guy, might as well do the promotion. We'll go with, uh... Whew, man. That aim is terrible. But, I guess it is what it is. And we'll give it to... One of you folks, these guys. Actually, I'm probably not going to give this guy to anybody. I might just get rid of him. He's pretty... He's pretty bad. 
He's got good base health, but other than that, he's pretty terrible. You know what? I am just going to get rid of him. Yep. People can be like, oh my god, he's a sergeant. What are you doing? You could argue that I should have kept him because he adds total ranks for the officer training school, but I just don't see that being a problem. Okay. Now, in terms of soldiers, let's go through this again. Him, I'm going to keep. I'm going to get rid of her. That was Tom. Tom's okay. Lauren. Yeah, we're going to get rid of you. Emma. We're going to get rid of you. Anybody with 60 aim, I think. That's going to be like... I think we need 65 or higher, honestly. Okay, that works. Just get decent. Nah. Goodbye. Okay, so let's hire some more soldiers. Let's get like... Six, five more? Five more seems reasonable. Okay. New engineers arrived this morning, Commander. We're always glad to have more help down here. Still excavating. Let's go ahead and go down a level. Yep, panic in Germany, panic in Russia. Excavation complete. Okay, excavation's complete. And we're gonna pop a power generator right there. So this would be like our power cluster. So we'll put a thermo here, and then we can put another thermo here. Those will be linked. And then we can add other facilities along the side here, if we want them. If we need them. We'll see how it goes. Commander, <clears throat> we've got another contact. Okay, scramble. Is a little bigger this time, though. Bangs out. Nice, good job, dude. Okay, so we'll ignore that for just a second. And go take a look at those soldiers. Okay. Chavez, Tom Harris, Paula Harris. They're cousins. Bridget Douglas, 70 aim. Okay. Whoa. Whoa, Zoe. Woo! How did you even get past the initial screening? Like, for reals. How'd you get past boot camp? Okay. Nope. Oh, getting rid of you. James Kelly, we're getting rid of you. Steven Snyder. 80. Okay, Steven, now we're talking. Wow, look at that. That's pretty badass. Okay, that will work. Engineering, build by. Is there anything we want to build? No, we already got two scopes. We don't need any more satellites right now. Satellite uplink facilities at maximum capacity. So we're potentially going to lose these two. Now we don't have to. We don't have to. But potentially we're going to. I think we're probably... better served by finishing... United States, because then we get air and space bonus. Saves us some cash on aircraft, or we could keep working on Asia and work towards future combat, because I want to get the officer training school up as soon as possible. So, you know what? Maybe we do that. We put satellites up over here, and then we make sure that we take any mission there is in South America, if we have to. We've been picking up some and then, if United States so gets sketchy next month, has been all over the news ranting about if, if something happens and these get get to panic level, we can drop a satellite there next month. But will we be able to? How many engineers do we have? Uh, and what do we pick up for the United States? Do we pick up engineers or scientists? Satellite uplink Engineers. So that means we'd pick up two. Which would put us at 13. Do we get engineers from anyone else? Yeah, so we'd actually pick up three engineers. Four engin- or one scientist. Three engineers and one scientist, so... That takes us to 14 engineers. That means before the end of the month... Well, actually before... The end of the first 10 days of the next month, we'd have to pick up like six engineers in order to be able to build 
another satellite uplink. Because we'd need 20. So, I don't know. These are the kinds of decisions that you gotta make in, in enemy within that you don't have to make in long war that often, because you can control the panic better. You have more tools. Hmm. Yeah, maybe we just let these go right now, then. They're not guaranteed to go? Or maybe they are. In long war, they're not guaranteed to go just because they're, like, capped out or whatever, but... We may lose both of these. Okay. Let's do this crash site. Okay, yeah, you're not gonna go. Uh, I'm not taking you either. Let's get... Orb. Okay, and I'm actually gonna sub in. I've got Night Owl in the lineup now. So we had that, um... Sergeant Sniper, reconfigured him, customized him or whatever, and turned that into Night Owl. So Night Owl, welcome back to the team, sir. So we've got Night Owl, Ed, Fell, and Orb. Let's go smash more alien faces. Excavation complete. Dropship has arrived. We're going to be putting down in Mexico for this mission. Reports indicate the UFO set down in a sparsely populated area. We need to stay sharp and eliminate the invaders. Copy that. Copy that. HQ, this is Big Sky. We are in position and awaiting further orders. Roger that, Big Sky. Strike one, you are green to deploy. Approach with extreme caution. Current enemy status at the site is unknown. Copy that. I'm on the move. Move dot up. That's what we're looking for. Oh, okay. Hey there, fellas. X-ray on the move. They're flanking us. Good shot. Why is that not gonna hit them both? Are we really out of range? Oh man, that's disappointing. Okay. Well, up we go. Get rid of this guy. Very good. Yeah, 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 yeah. And then... Hmm. 12% means from here it'll be about 40. Yeah, I'm thinking no. Okay, and then fell. Where can we put you, darling? We can put you over here for now. A little concerned about Owl be out, being out in the open. Okay, good. He jumped. That'll work. Thank you for your cooperation. Now I just need you to not hit anyone. Like side. shoot at Ed and miss or something. Oh, okay, that works. That should be two shots at like 70% for Ed, so. I'd say the aliens developed this unit with the intention of tracking and isolating single targets. It appears to have a sophisticated evasion system as well. Perhaps we should try to avoid those tentacles. What's with these hitting for three damage things? That's strange. There we go. Out of the game. Guns dry. Just use a sidearm. No way that just happened. 
Awesome, two for two. Okay, let's move up. I don't think we can get that. Maybe what we could do is we could take Orb and kind of just go along the side here next turn, wait, and then she could go over and grab it the following turn. I just don't know if it's worth it because we fought two groups, right? Well, technically we fought one group. There's still Seekers out here. That means there's at least two or three more groups plus the Outsider. Hmm. Not super, I'm not feeling super excited about going for that meld. Well, okay, hold on. I could be wrong if they're gonna serve themselves up like this. Oh, wow. What a shot. That was meant for a seeker, but we'll take it. And there's the seeker. Actually, if we're not gonna go for the meld, maybe we should just shoot just shoot this rocket and be done with those guys. Two turns to get over there? Yeah. Let's just let's just use the rocket. Suck on this. Commander, it would be preferable if we attempted to retrieve those canisters rather than destroy. Yeah, we, them. we we've retrieved a lot of them now. Don't don't hey, complain. Move back. On my Move way. up. Switch to the sidearm. Come to me, Seeker. Come to me. There's still one left, right? I'm pretty sure there is. Engage. Switch back to your main weapon. They're trying to flank us. X ray down. Nice, he got him with the pistol. Great, good job. All right, let's move up. Slide back over here. Let's switch weapons again. Let's go ahead and reload. Rock and roll. The ammo capacity is pretty limited. I'm rolling. Okay, let's creep up. We're green to go. Got it. Moving. So we've fought three groups so far, yeah? Affirmative. Headed there now. Take the corner. Okay. Go with her. Okay, looks like you got the angle, so that'll work. Okay, cut across. There's the outsider. Uh, that's not the way I wanted him to run, but... It's actually okay, because what we'll do is we'll just hide right here. Actually, we should have taken our shot with our sniper first, but that's okay. We're going to... Move over here. We're going to hunker. We're going to let that guy kind of move up on us. And we're going to stay out of sight until he comes around. 
we'll get him with either, you know, some sniper fire, or we'll use the assault. Watch the flanks. They're moving. I just want to see if we even have... Yeah, we, yeah we've got a good shot here. Let's take it. Wow. What did Al kill? Four? Everything by the I think he killed four of the nine. That was pretty awesome. Maybe he'll get a promotion. That'd be great. High fives. Psh. Nope. And Dot's wounded for four days. Okay, that's not bad, though. Picked up some malarium. A little bit of meld. Flight computers. Okay, good. Come in handy later. Oh, did something finish in here? Yeah. How much is that thermo? 240 or something? 200. Hmm. We need to save money for the officer training school when it's done, so... Yeah, we'll have to hold off. Now, let's see. We could sell... A couple of those. And we could sell a few more corpses of these. Ooh, a terror mission, huh? Okay, ignore that for a moment. We technically don't have to do it. I mean, we can. We will. We'll drop and do it, but... But, yeah, I mean... It will, if we're successful enough, it will actually lower the panic. This is one of the things in... Enemy within that I actually like better than Long War. And Long War, even if you do great on a terror mission, panic still goes up, which I always disagreed with. I was like, that's just silly. I mean, it's not. I get it. Like, if they come, you know, raffle stomping through a city, people would be panicked. Negative. Having that's said that, it's just so, like, anti, you know, <laughs> it, it lowers your enthusiasm level of doing them, let me tell you. All right. Well, let's see then. I think take the same team, and... Hmm... See, it's dangerous to go on these with no medkits, but... I want maximum amount of firepower, so... Well, if I take Knight out, who would I put in there? There really isn't anybody to put in there. Nope. Plus, he did awesome the last mission. Alright, let's go with this then. So we got Knight, Ed, Phil, and Mad Dog. Let's go smash more alien faces. Our target site is near the German border. Copy that. Solid copy, Big Sky. Strike one has been given the green light. Your highest priority is to Hey, there's a civilian. Any more that are close? He's the only one, huh? Alright. I'm rolling. On my way. Okay, Ed. Okay. To here. Copy that. Knight can hang out right there. We're going to get rushed by some chrysalids, I would assume. Oh, they're not rushing us. Okay. Interesting. Moving 
Copy that. I'm on it, Commander. Good to go. Come to me, aliens. Come to me. What's making that noise? Floaters. And other nasty things. Solid copy. Move your ass. You're safe. That's affirmative. Yeah, we're just gonna keep taking this On it. nice and easy. Do not want to overextend. We'll move up to that wall next. Oh, chrysalids are close. I hear you, chrysalids. I hear you. Mm. Oh, no, floaters, okay. Nope. Okay. Wow. Okay. I really thought that I that looked on to me. Headed there now. Nice. Good job. Yes, Commander. Okay, here's the chrysalids. Enemy ah, missed the target. We gotta get to that guy fast. That's a problem. Okay, not quite. Moving. Yeah, nice. Okay. Yeah, he's going to kill that civilian up there, unfortunately. Nothing I can do about it. I don't... I can't see him, so... Yep. So we're gonna have to deal with a zombie, but it's okay, I guess. In the grand scheme of things. Oh, nice one, Ed. Nice one. Hard to hit... Hard to hit a floater in the on the move like that. Can we maybe rocket those guys? That would be pretty awesome. Let's give that a whirl. Sure looks like it. Rockets away. Rocket man! There you go. Oh, promotion. Noise. Okay, so we have no ammo. Alright, well, what we're gonna do then is we're gonna back up. And we're gonna reload. Let's rock. Yeah, I'm gonna move back. So I don't know how close that other crystal it is. And none of our guys can take a hit from one of those. That was a good shot.
That's all right. That's all right. It's all right. It's all right. We'll deal with it. Here comes a zombie. <laughs> he gives zero. He gives zero craps about dropping. He's like, whatever. I'm already dead. How much worse can it get? Which, if, which, if you think about it, is you know, it's kind of true, right? It's like, it's like no big deal for him. All right. So let's do this. We'll move over here, and we'll take a free shot on this fella. Mm -hmm. firepower over here. And then grab a reload. Reloaded. And then... Come up here. So this is in the free shot, this isn't. And there's still one floater active. Yeah, there is. Hmm. Well, I should probably just shoot him from here then and just do rapid fire. That's the safe bet. Alright, we're gonna reposition just a little bit. Reload. And... Oh! Nice! High fives! Psh, psh, psh. I really thought we were going to see more bad guys. That worked out pretty well. I mean, we still saved 12 out of 18. It's not too bad. Not a single casualty among the entire oh. squad. Lots it's of promotions. Grenades. See, now, this looks like a good deal. Let me take two grenades. That's awesome. And then they do plus one damage if it's an alien or needle grenade. But how often, it just seems like, for me anyway, my heavies, I usually try to control the space with them. Use them for things like suppression, or, you know, in the case of Ed, because he's got high aim, I've been using him for, you know, shoot and then suppress, or take two shots, or whatever. I don't really move them up all that much, I just try to control the area. So for me, I think, the increased area of uh, effect on suppression, while good, it's the, it's the two more tiles for rocket attacks that's appealing. So I'm going to grab that. And then for Fell, we've got a choice between Close Combat Specialist and Bring Him On. Now that's... <sighs> close Combat Specialist, man, sometimes that, that really does, it just saves you. But you could argue taking three shots, which she has the potential to do with extra crit damage, is pretty hot. Nah, I'm sticking with my gut. I'm getting. I'm gonna get close combat specialist. It's just. It's just. It come, it's too handy. I've had it save too many soldiers. All right, so we got disabling shot or battle scanner. Well, I sure wouldn't mind having some battle scanners. Disabling shot's really good against things like mechtoids, but. Well, then again, I'm also gonna need disabling shot for captures. All right, let's grab it. That's going to be rapid fire. That one's kind of a no-brainer. Ooh, that was a good mission. Yep, we'll deal with metals later. Panic, in Germany decreased by three. Panic has decreased across Europe. So we talked about this before. Don't sure launch your satellites the before the end of the month. And this is exactly why. Because now we're in a situation where we don't have to worry about... Look at Germany's all the way down. And we don't have to worry about Russia leaving either, or the UK. So, we're in pretty good shape. But if we had launched the satellites beforehand, and lowered the panic, and then done that mission, it really wouldn't have done a whole lot for us. And we would have technically been wasting where we put the satellites, right? Yeah, just food for thought. Okay, let's see what we got coming up. Two, the officer training school, and five. Well, these are both in five, but two satellites, officer training school, arc thrower, and seven. Can Our we... suspicions may have been true after all. They're not just here for abductions. 
They have something else in mind. Five power and 85 bucks. And then we need like, I don't remember how much it is, 100 or 75 or something for our first squad expansion via the officer training school. Yeah, we better save our money for that. Okay, well, I hope you enjoyed this one. If you did, hit that thumbs up. Thanks so much for watching. Till next time, I'm Mal, and I'll see you later.